cute. How did the Ghetto Boys come about? So Ghetto Boys, Ghetto Boys is a is is obviously it's it's an Orteño gang. Yeah. On a 12th Street Merced, and uh, they came about like ninety six. 96, 97. Yeah. So it was just like it's my my older homies be, yeah. before my time, you know. They uh they were when they were kids, they were like 11, 12, 10, yeah. whatever. Yeah. Uh and they were our hood parks like McNamara Park and our streets 12th Street, 12th yeah. and K, right off the 99. And you know, they just they were just a bunch of ghetto kids just yeah. running around doing what they wanted, stealing Yeah. shooting robbing doing whatever yeah, yeah and there was really no control in them you know and um they just one day they're just like you know we're gonna call ourselves get Merce ghetto boys yeah uh, because everybody just kept going you guys are just ghetto boys you know you guys are a bunch of ghetto boys <laughs> yeah it's like fuck are we gonna stick to it and uh a lot of them you know uh either doing life uh killed still in prison yeah um a couple of some one one of the homies just got out not too long. We did like sixteen years. Yeah. Um, there's a lot of homies that 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 trip out when they see it now. They're like, "Damn, there's somebody named Ghetto Boy." Like I started yeah. that. Yeah. Uh, he got Ghetto Boy merch. He got the yeah. whole town on Ghetto Boy shit. Yeah. Like he putting us out there. Like yeah. I never knew it was gonna go this far. Yeah. So they 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 they're fully rocking with it too. Like yeah, yeah we fuck with it. I, I, I think that's tight. I mean. It, I, I mean, it's a really, it's a movement. Like, you yeah, know, yeah, yeah. I feel like sometimes you, I mean, it happens. Things become bigger than you, yeah. you ever thought of me. And I was yeah. like, all right, now everybody repping it now. But some yeah. people, they might never know where it originated from either. They're yeah. not even tripping. But yeah. I feel like the people who know, they know. Um, as far, like, knowing, like, the experience and, like, what has happened to people that what was that do gangbang, like, as far I thought, I saw you saying something about you, like you didn't want to promote it to the to the youth, like don't you're not you don't want to say like go out there and gang bang, but you also you wanted to let them know like what does come with it, like, exactly. Yeah, yeah. So my message is 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 changing, like as I as I grow as an artist, um, towards the youth is more like uh like exactly what you said like I, I don't i don't encourage anybody to go out there and gangbang but if you do you know like this is the way to do it and, and just know what it's going to come with and the end of the day it's your decision like i ain't never you know there's been kids like from the hood that asked me like hey bro i want to be from ghetto boys and i'm just like nah bro like yeah. one of my little homies uh i was like nah like you, you cool like like you, there ain't shit in this for you you know what i'm saying yeah and he's like fuck he's like all right it's cool and he got killed like five days later. So I'm like, man, like, that's that, you know, that's that's fucked up. You feel me that's with it with that? Yeah. So, yeah. And they, peace. Yeah. They, there's a lot of little kids out there getting killed, and I'm just like, bro, like, this isn't what I want to. You know what I mean? Yeah. I don't want to promote that. You feel me? But it, it is what it is. You know, it happens. Do you think like it's too encouraged in today's music? Like everybody wants to be. Not everybody, but I feel like a lot of kids do. They do. I don't say they want to gangbang, but they do want to be in the streets, quote unquote. Like that's yeah. like cool now. Uh I don't really understand this generation as far as that. Like, yeah. like, uh, yeah, just kind of putting themselves out there. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, you know, like, I guess it's different with music videos, but you know, like you could tell when somebody's doing it for the clout. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Like, not for sure. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like guns or money or whatever the fuck. You feel me? Like we're taught to like stay really under the radar. Um, as much as I put it on the music videos, like I said, like what I do on the music videos, as far as like I ain't got shit to hide. You feel me? Like yeah. I, I'm wearing my red rag, like I'm a gangbanger, yeah. yeah. a gun or whatever the fuck. You know? But like aside that, like on my social medias and. Like I'm not really out there like cloud chasing like that. Yeah. I just feel like I don't know. I mean, like you see all, all these rappers get indicted. Like I got yeah. indicted when I was 18, so I was like, yeah, man. Like, unless you you're, you're willing to do time for a picture, or a phone call, or yeah, thing, then by all means, like 
if not, yeah. yeah. I mean, Chains it looks, it look, yeah, it looks cool. You see the whole six nine shit, you yeah. know? Nah, for sure. Like it looks cool till you're till you're facing some real time. Yeah, dude, it's like it's not cool anymore. Yeah, you're like, oh yeah, yeah. You regret everything you do. Yeah, so nah, I mean, I, that's, that's facts. Yeah, 